Hello viewers, good day. At this very moment, as you all know, what we do here is to talk about politics and analyze government. Right about this moment, I am here to give us some knowledge or some awareness on some things that are happening in this our country, Nigeria. And number one of the headlines we are going to talk about here is uh, the issue of the unknown government that attacked uh, the NYC in Jigawa states. This unknown government attacks the NYC in Jigawa states. It took some, they made away with uh, their valuables and all of other things, you know. This shows that these people, they came to steal the students and they abducted some and do other kind of things to them. Who knows if they did not even, you know, you know, some. Uh -huh. So a lot is actually going on in this country. And this is as a result of bad governance we have in this country. And if nothing is being done about these bad governance, fellow Nigerians, I bet you in the few months time to come, we will not know this country anymore. Because the rate which banditry is escalating is in multiplying on daily basis, increasing in their hideous crimes against the citizens is becoming too much. Now, the other day, a few days ago or two days ago, or what is yesterday, the son of the monarchy was killed in Lagos at Lekki. You understand me? These are the kind of things we are talking about. This is insecurity and our governments are not doing anything about it. A lot is actually happening in this country. You people will know that during the end back Goswana protests, a lot of youths were arranged, were arrested by the Nigerian police force simply because they are protesting for their rights. And some of them have been remanded for 120 days by court order. Some of them 160 days. Some of them they, they are minor. Some of them are not minor. And this is illegal. This is the height of illicit acts that can be meted upon the citizens by its government. That illegal minors can be facing jail term, can be remanded in the prison in this kind of government that we call it called, uh, democracy. This is called dictatorship. And this is why youth campaign has urged Tinubu to stop dictatorship. Because this government now he, he, we are into is a government of dictating. He is a dictator. Therefore, we are the youth's campaign are urging him to stop dictatorship. You know what this means? The very moment the youth begin to get angry and start warning you about something, it simply means there is a fire that is preparing women not to start burning. And when they start, the fury is going to be too much. That is why I said I should come here and warn you, Bola Ahmed Tunubu. I am warning you now to do what is right, as you will not leave to tell the story. You understand me? This is getting too much. You are melting a lot of heat upon the citizens of Nigeria and we are suffering. We want to end it right now. Bola Ahmed Tunubu, end it right now.